As the World Water Day is being commemorated, the Cameroon Autonomous Union of Workers in the water, energy and gas sectors are pleading on government to put at the disposal of CAM water the necessary resources for the benefit of populations. We here in Cameroon have a lot of problems because the body that is in charge of uh, the management of water uh, has a lot of problems. So we are pleading to the government to make sure that CAM water who is in charge of that duty sustain so that Cameroonians can have clean and portable water and in quality and in quantity. We know that calm water has a lot of problems. It is only the government who can resolve the problem of calm water, not individuals. Hammering on the issue of privatization, Sinatec is categorical that water being a life-sustaining substance should remain in the hands of the state. Privatization brings poverty. The government has the obligation to give water to the population. To render that service to the population, we don't need to privatize. Well, all what we need is just to restructure calm water so that calm water will be up to the task, up to the original and be assigned by the government to deliver water to the population in quality and in quantity. Privatization can never be a solution. We work with partners like CAPA, PSI and uh, ACA to make sure that water remains in the hands of government instead of being privatized. Acute water problems recurrent in rural Cameroon is pushing Sinatec to opt for the municipalization of water distribution, followed by adequate management skills and resources. I should go back to the councils. Majority of councils has no access to portable water in Kabul, mostly in northern part of the country. So government to take care of that. If we say, if the government of Kabul say that a lot of comp some competence has been transferred to the government to the councils, the government to the same government should make sure that means also. That is financial means to be transferred to the council so that the council can be up to the task to sustain a small water scheme in rural areas. Populations on the 2022 edition of World Water Day are therefore called upon to protect water and make it safe for consumption by all.